<laughs> okay, hold up. Why, okay, why does everything, the lighting just choose to be horrible? It's to keep changing on me, just keep switching it. Hey guys, it's Rosalind here, and today I'm coming at you with like some questions or whatever. Uh, just kind of getting to know me. Um, I just thought it would be funny because I wanted it, I didn't want to do like a regular like TMI tag or get to know me tag. Like I wanted to do a funny one because those are funny. Basically, this is like a funny get to know me tag, I guess. So, first question What is the most awkward thing that happens to you on a regular basis. Okay, so I wear lipstick, right? And I've been wearing it a lot more lately. I always get lipstick on my teeth, no matter what. Like, my best friend clowns me for it, all of my friends clown me for it, and even my chemistry teacher clowns me for it. Like, I didn't wear lipstick today, because I was just like, nah, like I won't do that for the video, because I'm trying to have lipstick on my teeth. Number <laughs> two is, What's your worst bug related story? I am completely terrified of bugs. Like I just hope when I do have a boyfriend and get married that like he'll kill the bugs for me because I am not killing sp I do not kill spiders. No insects. Do not no. I don't even care. I don't like butterflies. Like I'm terrified. I just I can't. Basically, when was this? I think this was in kindergarten. Basically, we had a class pet and our class pet was frogs. I think it was fall break actually. When we had breaks or during the weekend, like kids can um, volunteer to take the, the class pet home and take care of it. Like, especially with their like parent consent or whatever. Me, um, I was just like, hey, like, can I take it home for the fall break? Like, my teacher was like, yeah, like, you can, just ask your mom. And my mom didn't want to say no, because I kind of asked right in front of her when she came to pick me up, and she was just like, yeah, let's do that. Obviously, she didn't want to do it. It was so funny. But like I said, I am terrified of bugs, right? <sighs> the frog's food was crickets, right? But they were alive. These weren't no dead crickets. These were alive, like making noises and everything. Like they're like in a little thing or whatever, in a container. Like, okay, well, I, I was cool with the frogs, but I didn't realize that we were gonna have to take crickets home like that. Not even the first this the first night. So my little sister, um, Dallas, she was like she was like four at the time. She stood on a chair because the frogs and the crickets were um, in the kitchen on like a counter. And basically she knocked down the crickets and the thing opened and they literally were everywhere. Jumped everywhere and we freaked out. My dad was more scared than any of us. Sorry dad, I know you watch my videos. I'm so sorry. I was so scared. Like we literally were getting bowls and cups and everything and just like going like that and just putting it over like the crickets just so that I don't know and my dad just started vacuuming them up and so we still had to deal with them for six more days so my mom had to go buy crickets at like a pet store or whatever so I'm just gonna like say random like ones or whatever <laughs> question three if you were stranded on a desert island what three items would you want to have with you obviously on an island you're not gonna get that much service on a phone but I think I would break a phone. Just because you might be able to get service somewhere. Obviously pictures, I am so stupid, but yes, I would I would just only care about pictures and literally not my life. I don't know, I don't think, ugh, that's horrible. I don't even think about my safety. I just care about pictures. Number four, which common saying or phrase describes you? Well, not necessarily describes me, but this is a saying that I say. I say independence is key because I believe independence is key. Like, you do not need to be in a relationship. You do not, you never need a significant other to be happy. Like, you can be happy with friends, with family. You can make yourself happy. Like, you don't need a significant other. Like, independence is key. What's my hidden talent? <laughs> Please don't hate me, but... I apologize in advance. <laughs> I think we're at four, I don't know, four or five. What's the most embarrassing moment in your life? I do crazy stuff on the regular. 
I just learned to get over it. Like, I don't really get embarrassed. Like, I literally do that stuff in class, what I just did. I don't really care. <laughs> I don't know where we're at, five or six. So, um, have you ever seen a ghost or an alien? I so, okay, this doesn't have to do with either because, I mean, I feel like I've seen a ghost before. I mean, yeah, whatever. <laughs> I've seen the tooth fairy. I'm not crazy. I have seen the tooth fairy. Oh, tooth fairy. Like, obviously, I don't believe in the tooth fairy, but like, I've seen the tooth fairy. Like, everybody makes fun of me for it if I tell them, and I'm just like, dude, I seen him, and my parents still think I'm crazy for it. But this was the day before Thanksgiving. My mom went like grocery shopping the night before, whatever, spent shopping stuff for Thanksgiving because we were having like a Thanksgiving like dinner with our family at our house. Right? So I specifically remember my mom bought. She bought carrots. I had lost my tooth that night and my mom was like, well, put it under your pillow. She's like, put it under your pillow. So I was like, okay. And so I fall asleep, right? And I wake up in the middle of the night and I look <laughs> and I swear, I seen a fairy, like it looked like a fairy from Tinkerbell. And I, I don't know if it was just like my imagination, but I swear it was a tooth fairy. And she was eating a carrot that came out my window. I saw window, as creepy as it sounds, I swear. I swear. Literally the next morning, I woke up so early and my dad was up cooking the turkey because you have to start that early because it takes like hours to make. Um, I ran and I was like, Dad, I seen the tooth fairy last night. It was when I seen her, I was like, hello, but like she, I swear this. I don't know if she put like some pixie dust or what, but I fell back asleep, okay? Number six or seven, I don't know. It says, would you rather be taller or thinner? I think I would rather be taller. I don't really care. Like, I'm 4'11". I'm not even five feet. Like, that's so sad. Okay, whatever, seven or eight. What flavor ice cream would you be and why? I feel like if there was a little bit of everything, like a flavor, <laughs> I'm mixed. And then I'm just... I'm too weird just to be like plain vanilla, like birthday cake thing, like with a bunch of sprinkles and stuff, you know, like a bunch of different colors and everything. Yeah, seven or eight or whatever. Have you ever locked yourself out of the house? I have, and I cried so hard. Everybody was getting ready to go, right? And I wasn't supposed to go in the backyard and play around, right? I did, and I didn't listen. In the backyard when nobody was looking because everybody was getting ready to go. I forgot where we were going. And my mom was like, you're not going in the backyard to play. Like, you have to stay in the house. Blinds were open because we had, like, blinds for the back door. The back screen door. And basically, I went out there, but I kind of hid to the side for a bit just so nobody would see me. So, I forgot who, but someone locked it. And then they closed the blinds. And I went back to look, and I was like, you're so I was yelling, right? And I was like, hey, like, hey, hey, I'm back here. And nobody was answering me. And I was like, yo, they're literally going to leave me here. Like, they're not going to know. <laughs> oh, my God. And so I started crying. And I was freaking out. I was like eight, I think, like seven or eight. And I, like, opened the screen door. I was, my fingers hurt so bad because I was, like, trying to dig my fingers between the screen door and, like, the wall or whatever. And I was trying to, like... You know, but it was locked, so the, a gate, right? But you can't open it from the inside of the backyard. You open it from the outside. And I was like, <laughs> what? Uh, whatever, eight or nine. What is my favorite song? Oh, it's around the holidays and everything. So Christmas songs are on my playlist right now. By the way, no copyright intended for any of these songs. So here's just some Christmas bops. So, um, I know I only did like eight or nine questions. I don't know. I lost track of how many I was doing. Uh, but if you guys want me to do something like this again, or you want to ask me questions, I don't know. I have any requests of any videos you would want to see, comment down below. I do have new videos planned, and I really hope in 2018 that I stay committed. Just expect more funny content and everything, and that's just what I like doing. I is, please like, subscribe, and comment. Happy holidays. Be safe for New Year's Eve. I plan on getting this up tonight or something. I don't know. We'll see. So, uh, thanks for watching. Bye. I feel like you guys are going to think I'm really weird just like after this whole video. But like, there's more to me. <laughs>